Hello there, Rec Poker Nation. Jim Reed here again uh, with another little tip on how to get the most out of Poker Tracker 4. So, one thing I love about Poker Tracker 4 is that it, it makes it easy for me to share my own hands with friends or coaches or other people that I'm trying to learn from. And uh, it also makes it easy for me to take hands from my students or my friends and uh, look at them myself, share them, analyze them in my own Poker Tracker system. And so I just want to go over with you a really simple process by which you can export your entire database. So we've got other videos about how you can export a certain hand or even a tournament or a set of cash games or something like that. In this case, we want to just export the entire database. Um, so this is a great way to get a really big picture view on your game and uh, ways that we can find to improve. Um, so we're going to go up to here. We're going to go to export hands, so database export hands and then just go to advanced and this just don't tick any boxes if you just leave all these open they'll download everything all at once and i've got myself as the active player here but this will actually also include all the hands that you have uh, viewed or other people's hands that have been added to your database so it doesn't matter who the active player is here it'll download the entire database and then just click export hands uh, choose a, a directory or a folder or make a new one. I'm not going to do it now because it starts a process that takes a while. But um, basically, that's all you have to do. And that'll download a bunch of different files, usually by site. And uh, uh, or depending on how many hands you have, it might be um, uh, it might be a series of subfolders. Uh, so basically, you do that once for cash and then make sure you go over here to tournaments Again, don't click any of these little buttons, any of these tags, just export hands, make a new folder or you choose the same folder. I'm going to click cancel, but you would just click OK and um, that'll download the entire uh, hand history, the entire all the hands in the database that are tournament hands. So then often that folder is going to be too big to send over email. Uh, not all the time. If you can send it by email, all the better. But if you want to share it with a friend, I like to use Google Drive or whatever it is that you use to uh, share pictures or videos with your with your buddies. Um, and then it's really easy for whoever wants to uh, analyze your database. They just come over here and instead of getting hands while playing, we just get hands from disk and we just choose that same folder that we've downloaded your database to. And that's all there is to it. So listen. Um, you can always go to rec.poker slash gym and see if there's anything fun there. I've got a ton of videos, uh, lots of ways to work with me or just to chat. Um, and of course, you can email me, jim at rec.poker, if you have any questions about Poker Tracker 4 or about getting more involved with Rec Poker. Um, yeah, so I guess that's all there is to it, folks. Good luck and uh, happy grinding.